jewelry and STDs. What? Then you need a trip to Nintendo Land for a crash course in knowledge! Hey, come on in, Pazano! Welcome to Nintendo Land, my little garbanzo bean! You've been selected to learn firsthand about all the changes your body's been going through lately. Huh? Here's a my brother Luigi now to tell you a whole heap of a spaghetti pile of information! Hello, Mario. Hello, I'm Luigi, and I'm here today to tell you all about puberty and its many effects. Puberty is a radical process whereby your body becomes an adult body, entirely capable of reproduction. Well, don't just tell him, Luigi! Show him! <laughs> Luigi, what's that? Yeah, what is that? This is the male penis and testicles. In boys, testicular enlargement is the first physical sign of puberty. The testes have two main functions, to produce hormones and sperm which are necessary for reproduction. Wow, I had no idea! Yeah, that's totally tubular! Within months of the testes beginning to grow, rising levels of testosterone promote growth of the genitalia, or penis. Pubic hair also appears shortly after the penis begins to grow. So that's what's been going on! But what in the name of lasagna lovers everywhere is puberty like for girls? In girls, breast development is the first physical sign of puberty. Oh. The second change is pubic hair growth. Finally, with girls, menstruation and ovulation begin to occur between 13 and 15 years of age. Ovulation is the production of eggs for the sake of reproduction, i.e. the joining of a male sperm with a female egg during sexual intercourse. And nine months later, a baby is born. So that's how it works! Speaking of bouncing a baby's Luigi, what about an unwanted pregnancy, STDs, and AIDS? Yeah, what about that stuff? Hey, Luigi, what's going on here? Yeah, this is totally black. Mario, we are here to learn that if you engage in sexual intercourse without the use of contraception or a condom, this could happen to you. But Luigi, how in the tortellini shapes can he avoid such a fate as this? Yeah, by wearing a condom or latex covering which is placed over the penis during sexual intercourse. The following exercise should demonstrate how effective a condom can be in avoiding STDs, AIDS, and teen pregnancy. Well, I sure have learned my lesson. I'll always wear a condom. That's a wonderful news, kiddo! Yes, but remember, the only way to avoid STDs, AIDS, and teen pregnancy 100% is to abstain from sex altogether. But if you are going to engage in sexual intercourse, make sure to wear a condom. And the why is that again, my pasta eating pally? Because as we all know, safe, safe sex, sex is, is the, the best! best.